Hello, this is Jordan, and welcome to the next episode of Let's Play Finland, where we are in a in a mm, silly war with the Commonwealth, where the real goal is a war with Denmark. And also, I've realized I don't actually need to just bring all my troops around here. Well, I certainly should do a lot of them. Some of them, I can just walk this way. And and something that I want to do, I want, I'd like to have, like, a 35 stack with a general here, and a 35 stack with a general here, so that... Denmark really doesn't want to go anywhere. Um, yeah, that's that's basically the plan. Uh, so for now, we'll let Brandenburg and even France come do my fighting against the Commonwealth for me. Uh, while I, since I have some money now, you know what I'm gonna go do. I I, I hate to do it, but I'm gonna do it. Uh, let's remove the mercenaries. Yes, high mercenaries, and let's see. This takes us from making 18 a turn to making 27 a turn yeah I mean that that's how we're actually gonna be able to afford to how wow okay um so this war's got to happen soon actually or else these other guys are just gonna peace out um no 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 what am I doing what am I doing uh yes uh let's also build one of you and Nope, not enough money. Okay, more of you. Wow. Yeah, no, for real. <laughs> uh, th thanks, guys. I think. Um, I mean, yes, but but no. Like, ple please do let me actually have time to prepare for another war. Okay, uh, and... Uh, no, we're not doing either of those. Uh, we're just gonna... Oh! Nice! More money! Okay. Um... And one of you. Uh-huh. Siege of Krakow's done. Alright, in that case, you guys come up to Danzig. Uh, at least Kazan is, is doing one of ours. A gain of base tax there. Wait, those are the same. Or 100 Diplo power. Um, you know what? For the base tax, I'll give up 75 Diplo power. That's basically what what that comes to. Um, and because we're gonna have we're gonna have to be careful because of the fact that. Um, that even after six months of a war, Denmark can call them in. Let's see, how's the Netherlands? The Netherlands is not in another war. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling like I, I gotta do this, like, crazy soon. You know? I, I, yeah, I mean, I'm, 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 feeling, I'm feeling a lot of... Pr I mean, because look at these sieges going. Look at that. Just look at that. That's a lot. Um, what is this? A revolt there. Eleven. Okay, let's see if this can work. Uh, okay. It keeps re-upping that for us. I don't know why. But we keep we keep having a diplo a relations limit of seven. No oh, frack. Seriously. Okay, let's build more. More, more, more. Um, let's, let's build them safely out here. Uh-huh. Okay, all, all y'all group up and go there. I think that's going to be our best deal. Let's see if this works. Come on, work, 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 work. Uh, that did not work did not work. Is this province being converted? No, it's already converted. Uh, you know what? I think it may be time. I think it may be time. Uh, what's the worst what's the worst that could happen? The worst that in fact, if that's the, if that's the case, then you go ahead, you go ahead over there. Uh-huh. All y'all, go there. You ships, stop doing that and go to the capital. 
Uh-huh. All right, as soon as we're in Mecklenburg... Oh, gosh, look at that. Yeah, okay, we, we just gotta go now. We just gotta go now. Otherwise... Frack! Okay, I got a fabricated claim. <laughs> Seriously? Um, sure. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that. I cannot believe that. I did not fabricate a claim. Okay, and more conversions. Yes, yes. Um, we will probably just accept their demands, because really, I can't afford anything else. Um... But, in that event, I should build some more infantry over here to be able to handle these situations as they arise. Wow, you are retreating a really long way. Okay, yes, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Bah! <laughs> I didn't have a single Cossus belly. Seriously? Uh, alright, well, at least their war enthusiasm and everything is high. Um, what's this? Uh, yes, I would love to gain some legitimacy. Okay, and what's this? This is another diplomat, sure. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I'm dying over here. Okay, well, it gives us time to build a couple more. Come on. Give me one of these now. Yes, and then two of those. Bah! I can't believe I did that, guys. I cannot believe I did that. All right, you come back over here. Uh-huh, and all you guys join up there. Mm-hmm. Now, I'm afraid that once we get up to 100, these guys, these guys are going to peace out. Come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, okay. Well, so now let's talk to them. Uh-huh. Accept demands. I'd lose 25 prestige. That's fine. Yep. Gone. Commonwealth Frank. Frack. Seriously? Um, oh, and we're at max admin points. Um... Oh man, we totally we totally missed our opportunity there. Uh, we're still three years ahead of time, but we're just okay. Fine, fine, fine. Ugh. Okay. Well, in that event, um, let's go siege them up ourselves. All right. Fine. Split you in half. Uh, no, actually, we'll leave you come this way. We'll just take you to Stockholm because that has a nice big supply limit. Okay, we, we missed that chance, we missed the chance, we missed the chance, all because of a stupid Cossus Belly not being in existence. Um, yes, I'm sure we did gain a Cossus Belly against Denmark. You know what, let's go fabricate some more. Ah! <laughs> wow. Wow. Well, we weren't, we weren't ready. You know, we weren't, I was, I wasn't ready. I didn't actually... I didn't actually take advantage of planning. I didn't I didn't actually do it. All right, so let's drop siege and go there. We'll take some Polish uh, some Commonwealth provinces. It'll be fine. Yeah, it'll be fine. We'll just figure out how to do it right next time, you know. Uh but while we're here, Let's give our troops over here some actual power. There we go. Now that should be an army that can actually deal with rebels. Uh, nope. <laughs> okay. Wait, this one's occupied by... Oh, occupied by me! As is Kraka... Oh! Oh! Oh, all these colors are me! Oh, that's nice! Why, thank you! I suppose I should say thank you to my, um, to my vassals for doing that for me, huh? Alright, colony self-sustaining. This, wow, that one already? 
Okay. We're just gonna keep heading over. Also, something I noticed. Look at that. Portugal. They got all the way there. We are not gonna get Siberia alone. It's really, it's really rather sad. Um. No, we won't do that. Siege of Kelno. Okay. Uh. You go to Ostpressen, I guess. You go to Ostpressen, too. Uh, well, let's take a look. Let's take a look. We've got 99%. That's a lot. Um, you have no treaties. We... Yeah, none of these are really especially interesting to us. So basically, we're going to want you to cede some provinces. So, what if we have you cede... These are the two sixes. And we're watching the war score for... Um, no, I want to I want to watch the war score for vassalage. Uh <laughs> then okay, woo. All right. Um these two, how much uh it would give us some pretty massive overextension, but that's okay. Um aggressive expansion. Who would actually really care? Austria would not be happy. The Commonwealth of course would not be happy. Hungary wouldn't Magdeburg, Venice, Switzerland, the Papal State, Pomerania, and then everyone else is in the single digits. You know what? I think that's okay. Uh, and then you give us any... You won't even give us any money. Um, why, why not? Uh, fine. And then revoke cores. Like, all over our territory. Okay. Turn cores. Nope, nope, nope. Alright. Cool. So there we go. Send a man. And we are at peace. Meaning, these guys. Let's see, how much is it going to cost? Two. Haha. <laughs> two eleven. Alright. Um. <gasps> Oops. Oops. I gave that one to Brandenburg. Okay. Good job paying attention once again. Um. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Oh well, that's okay, that's okay. Cause you know what? I I actually needed I actually needed time because our army is nowhere near our force limit. Um in fact, let's see, do we still have any mercenaries? We do. Somewhere. Where are the mercenaries? Mercenaries? Mercenaries are there. Alright, let's delete them. Are there mercenaries here? No. Are there mercenaries in this group? No. Uh was that the end of the mercenaries? Yes. Okay. So we now are a mercenary list army, um, which is good. I wonder. Are they? Are they? Are? Oh, they're they're converting it first. Okay. Oh, that's fine. Um, Nizhny Novgorod. All right. Let's. Oh, we have a nice little army here. Let's take you guys. This oh oh right we can go through Kazan, I almost forgot. Yeah, you guys meet up. Um, buildings. Oh 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 oh. Also, let's see. What was it that I was looking at? This. Oh my gosh, docks. I need docks in like these places, like major big time. Because if I can get more just static trade power this way, here, that's fabulous. Okay, uh, who's back? Fine, fine, fine. Um, let's see, we have 79% trade power there. Uh, now, I do have a guy here, but maybe that's not the most effective use of my merchant. For how okay, you were going to do an experiment. So right now, we are making 22 Point one five. Since we have such a huge control of the node here, I want to see what happens if instead I move him to Krakow, which has some decent decent power. So let's transfer trade. Let's take the one from Novgorod. So if we are making 22.15, let's see what happens when he gets there. Uh-huh. Wow. 
Okay, no, we actually do need a merchant there. We, we in fact, do need a merchant there. Okay, well, so transfer trade power. We'll take the one back from Krakow. Wow! Now, how in the world... If we have the most trade power, we apparently just have to tell it where to go. Because everybody everybody else just pulls it that way. Okay, so, uh, uh, all right, all right, all right, all right. That's what we have to do, huh? Uh, nice, another province finished. So that was this guy. Um, oh, right, that one was the one that finished. So, he's not even there yet, dang it. Okay, uh... You know what? We're going to split you in half. Wait, no, 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 no. We will we'll do it this way. We'll create a new unit. We'll take that. Select it. It'll go there. But the king and his, uh, and his <laughs> hopefully death stack will just sit there. Um, all right. Uh, oh, good. Crimea is falling apart. I love it. All right, you guys, let's say, let's tell people to attach to you, and we'll let's go kill these Muscovite nationalists. Uh huh. Yeah, sure. Mem looks and hedges. There we go. All right, let's actually tell you to go here, and then we'll even tell you to auto rebel hunt. Imagine that. Uh, all right, what's this Hedges War? This is the Kiel uh, Hedges Conquest of Bahrain. Um, all right, there's a there's there's stuff going on over there. Uh, what was it I was gonna do? Right, 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 right. Dock back to here. Uh, no, we did do it there. Um, well, let's give ourselves more. Wait, which trade note is that in? Yes. Let's give ourselves more trade power there. Um, apparently we need it. Actually, what we should do is build some ships and patrol the Novgorod node because we're just losing those 3.41 every turn because of that. Ugh. Um, fine. Ships. Yes. Do I have anywhere I can build them more cheaply? No. And we will patrol Novgorod. Oh! Oh my gosh! My ships that I had... Uh, bah! Uh, Baltic Sea. Yes, that should also help. Um... Okay. Seriously. You guys go there. Uh, we'll let the month tick. I don't think that... I don't know if that really helped very much. Um, oh, nice. We converted Kiev. Now, that that should help. Uh, fine. Fine. I hate to do it. I do. Uh, let's get those guys built and patrolling Novgorod. All right, we've got... Uh, Norway, you need some improved relations. Kazan, you need some improved relations. Uh, we're still at 5 out of 7. Serbia freaking loves us. Um, did we ever... No, we need to complete that. I want, would they vassalize? They... Wouldn't, but maybe they would if their opinion was better. That's a little weird. Uh, yeah, Pomeranian's backing Hess. Yeah, that's that's a really good job. Uh, I mean, really good idea. I I promise, it's a really good idea. You, let's go improve relations with you. Yes. We just have to make sure that Brandon. But what is this? Uh, no, I won't. I don't want an alliance, Pomerania. See, we re we rejected their alliance, which hurts our which hurts our relations. It does, sadly. Uh, and more early frigates. 
for Novgorod. Because that is 13.2. That's a lot. That's a lot of trade power just sitting there. Uh, you guys go... No, go back there. What's our map look like? It's this one province that we can't... Because of the local autonomy that we that we accepted. Ugh. But hey, at least at least we like are starting to have an army again. Uh alright, there we go. You guys meet up meet up there. Ooh, we can build more. Now the question actually is... Uh, oh, this one finished. Yes. For that. Uh, and we're working on Lublin. Now are you... Core... You converted it, but you're not coring it. You're just... You're you're not so interested in that. Um, oh, Hungarian Patriots? Okay, that's alright. Um, so my goal is to actually be ready to do the same thing again. All right, now you protect trade in Novgorod, where we have 237. Let's see, we go from 84% with the month ticks. Does that help? Uh, still 84. Dang, that's a lot. Um, Denmark is trying hard. Now, granted, but they'd be pulling this way, right? Are they pulling that way? They're pulling that way. Okay, yeah, they are. They are really... Everybody's really trying. Uh, Rack annulled treaties. Well, that sucks, because Iraq's a one-province miner. And more. More frigates. More, more lightships. More trade in Novgorod. No guy still hasn't gotten rid of their pretender rebels. Alright. Uh, we meet up. Let's do this again. Protect trade. Novgorod. Love to see this get up above 80. <laughs> yeah. Um, now, within the Novgorod node, we have Muscovy and Novgorod as the important centers of trade. So that's another thing we could do, is build buildings of those types. Well, uh, okay, recall diplomat, recall diplomat. Let's see. We've got those two there, so we need that. We'll get there in just a second. Uh, no, not yet. There we go. Well, that should actually help quite a bit. Um... Now the that one the canal the canal isn't as big for just local trade power, but then the road networks are huge. They're huge. They're huge, huge, huge. Uh, now also within the Baltic node, we need to be thinking about that. But that's why we did. Um, that's why we built some stuff recently. What were those? Those were the docks. Yes. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I feel the need to get my financial house in order. Okay, Cord Lublin, that's nice. Um, and now we can convert it. Recall Diplomat from Pomerania, yes, yes. So you, Novgorod. And, no, 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 buildings. Docks. Uh... Marketplaces? No, I'm gonna. S no. Nope, I'm gonna save. So let's see. What's the vet? The, this node is very valuable. Very, very valuable. Uh, an offer to sell a province from Brandenburg. They'll sell us for fifty. Yep. Done. Amazing, because we even have a... No, I thought we had a claim. We apparently don't have a claim. That's okay. Spend 120. We should have claimed it. <laughs> I never thought 
I I have never been offered a sale before. Never. Not once. Not once. Not once. Uh either lose two stability or lose a stability and tons of money. Well, I'll lose the tons of money. Yes, I'm sure we took some pretty massive loans. Well, I guess I guess I know what we're financially doing for the next little bit. Um actually, you know what I want to know? When is our cruise up? Cruise is almost up. Um All right, so the math on this. So it's 1500 Oh, and France is in debt. So I bet by the time it's over... Uh, now, why accepting would destabilize... Why is that only 250 for Brandenburg, but 500 for France? Um, which means, actually, we need to... Let's get another claim. Another claim. And let's go to Denmark and get another claim, too. I don't want that mess happening again. Uh, let's, let's claim Skåne. Huh? Hey, but look at that. Our manpower is actually recovering. And our army is at size 120. I mean, that's pretty good. Let's, let's check this out. The, we definitely have the biggest army in the world. Major big time. We're way bigger than Denmark's army now. Um, yeah, our force limit is like just giant uh okay and you cost of reducing war exhaustion that's fine and then the next one is military tech uh minus 10 percent then we get oh, come on show me the bonus is leaders uh, we get another leader without upkeep okay plus then all these things let's see we will get uh, oh, well, so these are policies we could do. We could do that build costs are 15% less, or cavalry combat ability 10% more, or diplomats plus one and spy offense plus 10%, uh, or, ooh, spend military points to get two yearly, uh, uh legitimacy. Now, that's giant. Uh, and then national revolt risk minus one and missionary strength plus one, um, Wow, yeah, this is this is interesting. Really, really interesting. Um, now, if you do espionage, yearly legitimacy plus two. And, and I read somewhere that that legitimacy is either legitimacy or Republican tradition. It also can count towards that. Um, so it can be pretty interesting in that way. So, all right, guys, I think that's good for today's episode. We apparently have to save up a massive amount of money to repay uh, almost a thousand ducats is what we've got to do and right now we're making three per turn um, or let's see what please tell me that's gonna be more oh damn it okay um, that doesn't sound so fun uh, we'll lose the 50 diplo power sure um, yeah. Ugh. Okay, how am I gonna make more money though? For reals. Uh oh no, I am not losing air strength, air claim strength. Nope. Nope. Also, he can become king any day now. Just, just FYI. I'm totally okay with that. Uh. I wonder if maybe we can't afford a level 3 anymore. I mean, if we're way ahead of time, we maybe actually don't need a level 3. It is really prestige, which is nice. We can only go down to 2. Okay, anyway, we'll figure that out, and I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching.